could suppose what together we'll find with every pair of shoes that we try. We'll have a new adventure, you and I. Where will my feet take me today? Nobody knows for sure. Don't you think it's time to clean this mess before you play something else? Huh? Tea, Mr. Elephant? Yes, thank you. <sighs> well, I think I'm going to clean my toolbox so it's nice and tidy, and I can find everything I need. Doesn't that sound fun? <laughs> There. See how fun it is to clean, Franny? Crash! Bam! Boo! What, Grandpa? Now, Franny, I. A new customer! <laughs> and what can we do for you? I'm going to the jungle. To the rainforest, even the Arctic tundra. But my last exploration was the most dangerous of all. Cleaning my cupboard. What a mess. Cleaning, you say? Did you hear that, Franny? And I discovered my boots. And in my boots, I discovered a hole. Ah, yes, I see. We'll have them ready by Friday. In the fix-it box they go. <laughs> Where will my feet take me today? Hmm. I've been here before. It's the jungle. <laughs> My good friend Morrison the monkey must be around here someplace. Morrison? Hey, Morrison! Oh. Guess he's tired. Hey, Franny, it's me, Zelda the wild boar. Hi, Zelda the wild boar. Hmm, but you don't seem so wild. It's true, I'm not. But you're a wild boar. You laugh and dance and sing and pounce. Whee! <laughs> now I'm just a boar. Every time I try to do something, I slip on a banana peel. Applesauce. There's stuff everywhere. Banana peels. Coconut shells. Jungle toys. This jungle's a mess. Ever since Morrison learned how to climb, he's been littering the jungle floor. Look, he even litters in his sleep. Leaping litter bugs, you're right. This place is a mess. Nobody can do anything. We have to get Morrison to clean up. Hey, Morrison! Morrison, wake up! It's me! Uh, oh, Franny? Franny Van Duzzi! <laughs> you should have told me you were coming for a visit. I would have... Uh... Cleaned up the place? No, made some banana cream pies. They're de delicious! When'd you get here? Just in time, I'd say. Come down to the ground and have a look. Why would I go down there? I've got everything I need up here. Bananas, coconuts, even you're here. That's why you haven't noticed your mess. Mess? What mess? 
Yeah, that's my stuff. <laughs> now, let's go find some banana cream pie. So, what did he say? Is he coming? I've got some bad news. Morrison's not coming. It's just you and me and this mess. I bet if someone cleaned up, Morrison would see how much nicer it is and never want to litter again. <gasps> but who? Like I said, it's just you and me and... Huh? You and me. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? We could be the ones to clean up this mess. We could be the ones to show Morrison how nice a clean jungle is. Oh, that's just so well, it might work. <sighs> now that is a clean jungle. Brand new. Watching you exercising made me hungry, Banana. Morrison, we weren't exercising. We were cleaning up because Zelda wants to be a wild boar again. Well, why didn't you say so? Let's play ball. That's wild. Playing ball is wild, but we can't play anything here. Because the jungle is such a mess. What are you talking about? <laughs> huh? What mess? I don't see a mess. <laughs> Monkey out of control! Come on, we have to save him. Zelda, watch out! <laughs> I'll save you both, Franny style. Maybe not! <laughs> Uh, <coughs> Is everyone okay? Yeah, but all of our hard work was for nothing. Look at this mess. Hey! Where's the ball? It's gone! Did you hide it? No, it's in here somewhere. You think so? Hmm. I don't see it. Oh, but maybe if... What are you doing? Isn't it obvious? The ball's not gonna find itself. We have to tidy this place up. Not to mention it's dangerous with all these banana peels around. That's what we've been trying to tell you. So, are you gonna come and help or what? Yeah. <laughs> what a messy monkey. <laughs> this is fun. And there's lots of room to play now. And I can be a wild boar again. But I still don't see the ball. You guys? Hmm. There it is. Sure is wild! <laughs> what a great busy day! Grandpa cleaned up, Mr. Explorer cleaned up, Morrison cleaned up. <gasps> Are you thinking what I'm thinking? I'd better go. I have to clean up too. <laughs> hey guys, I have to skedaddle. The shoe shop needs me. See you later! Come back for a cleanup party soon! Bye, I will! That was monkey rific! <laughs> <laughs> A 
another treasure for my shoebox. Franny! Not now, Grandpa. I'm busy. Are you doing what I think you're doing? Are you cleaning? Well, I was in the jungle with Zelda and Morrison, and Zelda couldn't be a wild boar because Morrison was such a messy monkey. So we all realized that playing is fun, but cleaning up is important too. Get it? I see. Yes. I think I get it. That's very smart of you. I know. <laughs> Where will my feet take me tomorrow? Everything's ready for the guest of honor. Briona, I have a surprise for you. Briona? Briona? Oh no! Grandpa, Grandpa! Franny, what's wrong? It's Briona, she's gone. Calm down, Franny. Briona can be far. Just think back to where you might have put her. I don't remember. Retrace your path, step by step. I'm sure you left her someplace close. A customer. What can we do for you today? I need these for a toga party we're having at the community college tonight. The straps are broken and the soles have holes. These certainly are sad sandals, but we'll fix them up for sure. Can you put these in the fix-it box, please, Franny? Sure, Grandpa. <laughs> Where will my feet take me today? <gasps> Fantastic! Looks like I landed in the perfect place to watch. Duck! <gasps> ah. Woo! That was close! I'll say. Hey, Polonius, watch where you're throwing. Holy moly! Look at all those athletes! What a big track meet! The biggest! The Olympics! My name's Titus, and that's my big brother, Adonis, over there. He's the best Olympic athlete in all of Greece, and I am his equipment manager. Wow, that's great, Titus. I'm Franny. Hey, Franny, I have to go and check my brother's gear. Want to come along? That would be fantabulous. Adonis has different equipment for each event in the pentathlon. Discus, javelin, running, jumping, and wrestling. Ready, Franny? Ready. One discus, washed and waxed. Check. Two running sandals, tightened and oiled. Check. One javelin, polished, sharpened, and... Wait, where's the javelin? The what? The javelin. It's a long silver spear. My brother throws it. I don't see it anywhere. Oh, no. I've lost my brother's javelin. If I don't find it, Adonis will be disqualified from the Olympics. Don't worry, Titus. It has to be here someplace. I'll help you find it. It's gone. I'm doomed. If only 
I could start this day all over again. Wait a sec. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? That's a great idea, Titus. What? We're going to start your day all over again. But how? Close your eyes and think back to this morning. You're just waking up. What did you do? I got up and I ate my breakfast on this very bench. I remember I had the javelin with me. No javelin here. Then what did you do? I went to the track. Okay, let's retrace your footsteps. I walked past the fruit cellar and I stopped and bought a peach. No javelin. Then what? I'm sure I went straight to the Colosseum. Let's go. We're back where we started, Franny. And still no javelin. Are you sure you came straight here? Yes, I... No! Wait! I stopped and watched the wrestling tryouts from the stands. Where? Over there. I see something silver. Is that it? That's it. That's it. Let's get back to the track. We don't have much time. Discus. Check. Running sandals. Check. Javelin, all sharpened and ready to go. Check. Check and double check. Everything's ready for Adonis. Just in time. Uh-oh. We better get seats. Let the games begin. Yay! First up, the long jump. This is so exciting! <laughs> That's not the way to do it! <laughs> That's really not the way to do it! There's Adonis! He's about to jump. Hooray! We did it! That's my brother. Adonis is doing fantastically. He's in the lead. All he has to do is throw the javelin. His best event. without your help. Thanks, Franny. We couldn't have done it without you. You're welcome. Well, I should be getting home now. See you, Franny. If you ever need some Olympic excitement, you'll know where to find us. Bye, Titus. That was Olympic. <laughs> a laurel leaf, like they used to make Adonis's victory wreath. <laughs> Another treasure for my shoebox. Now to find Briona. I 
went to Grandpa's shoe shop this morning, and I wanted to have a tea party for Briona. I took out the tea set, then Grandpa called me, and... Oh, I remember! Briona! <laughs> oh, I see our wandering bear has returned. How did you find her, Franny? I retraced my steps, Grandpa, the same way Titus found Adonis' javelin. And it's a good thing, too, or else he would have been disqualified from the Olympics. Adonis, Titus, Olympics. I thought you were having a tea party. I am. And now that the guests of honor are here, we can all have tea. Guests? Yes. Briona and you, Grandpa. Well, thank you, Franny. Let's all go have a nice cup of tea. Where will my feet take me tomorrow? Mm -hmm.